How to keep sea sponges as pets in fish tank Keeping sea sponges as pets in a fish tank is a fun and relatively easy experience, but there are a few things to consider before you do. Here's how to do it. Requirements for the tank 1. Seawater Sponges and invertebrates in saltwater also need to survive in a saltwater aquarium with stable parameters. Prepare a six-month tank for the sponge with a complete biofilter to dispose of the sponge waste. To dot water quality parameters varies depending on the type of sponge. The optimal water temperature, salinity, and water quality for a particular sponge can be scientifically determined. Regular testing and adjustments ensure stable conditions and low parameters are maintained. 3. Current Most sea sponges are adapted to a moderate, indirect current. Strong currents and turbulence displace the delicate structure of the sponges so you should avoid such currents. Look for a calm, renewable current that carries solid particles to the sponges. 4. Lighting Lighting requirements vary. Some sponge species thrive well with little indirect sunlight, while others develop algae and die if there is too much sunlight. Try to find the proper lighting for your sponge species. Feeding Filter feeders Sea sponges are not plants and do not photosynthesize. They are filter feeders and extract food particles from the water column. Plankton, an aquarium with healthy microfauna and phytoplankton, will provide some food for sea sponges. Supplemental feeding Additional feeding may be necessary, especially in smaller aquariums. Use commercially available live phytoplankton or plankton substrates to ensure a constant supply of food particles. Be careful not to feed too much. Too much food can clog the sponge pores and damage the sponges. To avoid this problem, you should set up an automatic water supply to stabilize the aquarium's water quality and salt content.